What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Saga Log. I am nervous as frick. Um, like, if you take the nervousness scale and times it by like a hundred, that's how nervous I am. So, we have our bit of boy 50k, and 50k won't fit on my shoulder, sadly. But, well, maybe, maybe, maybe 50k will sit on my shoulder. No, it won't sit on my shoulder. Dang it. 50k, I wanted you to be like Dino. Okay, you can never be Dino. I'm sorry, 50k. You couldn't be Dino. But, <laughs> 50k told us that we needed to grind so that we actually were fine for Cyrus 2.0. Um, 50k was also mad because last episode, there were some sads. And I got to give you a team recap, which I am not a fan of. <laughs> Um, what I mean by not a fan of is I'm not a fan of the fact that I have to give you a team recap because something died. So, we have Brittany, who's level 53, with own tempo, heat wave, aqua jet, fly, and surf, the 2-7 that everybody loves and needs. Um, we have Babe, who's just a total babe, with careful nature, no guard, so doesn't miss any moves, which I need to create an addendum to uh, addendum i don't think it's the right word but i was like oh my gosh i can't use rock climb because it has a chance to miss i've got no guards so that doesn't matter um so addendum made um we have dak on with the black sludge sassy nature with that plus special defense minus speed Mwah! that's actually pretty good for having a quad weakness to psychic low kick bulk up poison fang and toxic we have lucario the ferret with a jolly nature because he's so happy with mold absorb shadow claw strength uh, psychic type judgment extreme speed then we got our manager Ernesto out here with the lax nature with the runaway ability because you know not really a great ability for a manager but you know it's fine it's fine Ernesto you're killing it tail glow air slash bug buzz and u-turn fits the runaway nature and last but not least I asked you guys in the comment uh, below or not the comments in my discord server to see if you guys can get a Pokemon with a specific base stat distribution. Now, that seemed like a really weird question. Why would I ask that? Because we have Roomba, who's going to dance around the party, have a great time. He's a little impish, so he's got to be in the back of the room. But you know what? It's fine. You know, you can dance around the back of the party in the corner of the room. It's not like I've done that before. With, unfortunately, Volt Absorb. Ugh. I saw that and wanted to cry because you guys don't know why I wanted to cry when I saw that the immunity procs first which means that it goes immunity no volt absorb because I have to be hit by it but if I'm not hit by it and can't get hit by it then it doesn't matter with avalanche earth power hidden power and icicle spear now two bits dead Right before the section that we would have utilized 2-bit. Yay! <laughs> it's not good at all. It's not shaping up to be a great situation because our team is going to potentially get decimated. Um, I say that wholeheartedly knowing that I probably shouldn't put that into the universe. But we have double battle fights galore today and... If I get double targeted in the position that I'm at, I am just frick frack. Luckily, they don't have six months. <laughs> Woo! Because if they both had six months apiece, we'd just die. I just, I just know it. We'd just be dead, and I'd have to live with it. But we have Dudley with a... a, 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 a oh my gosh! <laughs> ah, remember when I said I was dead? Remember when I said I was dead? Yeah, luckily this is the first battle, but these battles get increasingly higher level. So what I mean by that, these guys' aces are 46, the next pair's aces are 50, and Cyrus's ace is 55. Like, dang! Like, it couldn't get any crazier than just boom, by the way, you're gonna die. And it's like, oh, well, I wasn't expecting that to happen, but okay, fine. Um, and what sucks here, um, is Ernesto is one of my more defensive Pokemon. Yes, you heard that right. 
Ernesto. A Yon Mega is one of my most defensive Pokemon. And I have a weakness to ground. <laughs> this is gonna be so bad. I am not ready for this. I am not ready for this fi these fights. I'm going to die. I am 100% going to lose Mons today. If, if, if I'm gonna get thrown Mons like this the entire episode, I'm losing Mons. I'd like, at least I can accept that fact. Because what is this gonna do to the slacking? I mean, hey, it did over half. Slacking uses a special move, though. It did nothing. Groudon, please. Gro oh my god. I got double targeted. What did I say? I don't think I die. But getting double targeted means I'm forced to I'm, I'm already in a heal loop. Oh, that's not good. Okay. So the fact that I'm already in a heal loop, I'm going to air slash the slacking. And then just use my heal loop on uh, Ernesto. Because, again, that makes the most sense. Our, look at our team's HP, though. Like, we're going to get to a point where everybody has over 200 HP. Like, that is insanity to me. Like, everybody in this game is going to have 200 plus HP. I need to move the sparkling ice. Because this ice is covering the time. And I have to leave it at a specific time because I have to go to work. <coughs> I have this thing that's called work. And it's going to be great. Um, Yeah, we got one down. I actually got to double check. I, oh, I'm being really hyper conscious about it today. So I'm like, is it 4.30? No, I know it's not 4.30. I believe it's 5. Oh. I believe it's five, but I gotta double check, so. Because of course I'm freaking out about it. Um, when I, on the video. But it's gotta be five, right? It's five to 12.30, I swear. If it's not, and I'm being crazy. Yeah, five to 12.30, okay. I was like, I swear to goodness. <laughs> ah, Swampert, crap. Um. Here's the thing. They're both ground. Do I have something that... I don't think I have a Pokemon that resists water. I do not have a Pokemon that resists water. Shoot. And nobody's bulky enough for me to be like, yes, I'm sending you in. Ernesto took 70 damage. That's not 70. That is 60. Ugh, that's bad. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and bug buzz. And double target into that. Um, Double target into the ground on. Honestly, the fa the problem is, is Brittany cannot click surf because Brittany clicking surf means that the ground on, um, uh, or that Ernesto gets hit. Good. It didn't make a noise. That was weird. Okay. Water gun. Okay, we know that's fine. And it's a Foratress. Hmm. So I believe we have already learned that Heat Wave is a dual target move. Which, yeah, does that mean it does not do anything to the Swampert? Yes, but it kills the Foratress. So it's definitely... It now definitely... That miss... Oh, oh that was beautiful. Thank you, Brittany! You guaranteed killed the fortress! Not like you probably did guarantee kill it already, but I am a-okay with you missing that swampert and focusing all of the power on the fortress. Because that's how it works. So like if something misses, it does more damage to the other thing. So I am very okay with that. Thank you, Brittany. Mwah. Love you, girl. Um Keep up the amazing work. Um honestly though, Brittany is such a good two seven. Brittany takes care of, like, a lot of our needs. Like, it's like, oh, you have this need? Yeah, don't worry. But the thing is, is, like, in double battles, Brittany is not that great. Like, honestly, if I didn't have to use Brittany right now, I would not be using Brittany right now. Um, but we don't have a grass type. We haven't had a grass type in a long while, if not at all. Um, oh, accuracy. Oh, crap. 
I'm still going for it. I'm still going for it because I think... Yeah. I was wrong, by the way. I was going to say, I think that Aqua Jet still kills from that range. It did not. But... Again, Ernesto being in the front of the party works. Because now I'm not fighting... Now I have... I'm not fighting two at once with my Pokemon. Because... Nick wants to help us against the commanders that are scary. Which... Here is another problem with this fight. You ready? If they target into Nick, Nick only has three Pokemon for this fight. So, this could easily become a 2v1 fight. And if it becomes a 2v1 fight, I will be in big trouble. And like I said, I am nervous for this episode this episode is the episode that i'm the most nervous for 100 percent. you can't question it i won't even i'm gonna tell you right off the bat it's this and the elite four those are the uh, victory road i guess there's a lot of episodes that i'm nervous for but i'm always a nervous nelly so it makes sense but <laughs> this episode right here has a lot at stake for the future of this playthrough and where things are going because is fighting, let's say, Volkner going to be something that I'm concerned about? Yes, because Volkner's a gym leader and everybody's going to be in the 50s in that gym. So, yes, of course I am concerned and there is reason for worry. There is reason for doubt. After Volkner, though, everybody is lower level. And the only thing that I would have to worry about from that point on is getting into the area at level 70. The fact that I have to go in there at level 70 scares me. But that is how it goes. I believe it's level 70. I gotta double check again, but it might be like 66, but I thought it was 70. Ah, there's no need to rush, honey. Like, oh my gosh, I understand that you want to battle the boss like real, real bad. I understand that you know, I had a galactic member that had a lovely Salamance, but, like, ugh, you don't have to progress it this quickly. Like, you gotta go through me, and after all, like, you made me look bad so many times. I haven't, you didn't lose a wand to me at all. Oh, it's Mega. I keep calling it Nick. Why do I keep calling it Nick? There is, why? I don't know why I keep calling it Nick. Nick's just gonna be our next rival. You know what? It's just, Nick is apparently enough of a rival for him to be on my mind constantly, okay? Like, Nick, I 1v1 you, okay? No, I'm joking. I wouldn't 1v1 you. Um, okay. Oh, I thought this said Elite Trainer Joy. He's like, yes, Joy's an Elite Trainer. We, we knew that Joy was an Elite Trainer. Joy's amazing. Uh, Vaporeon and Pidgeot. So, um, clearly Joy's the one with the Aurum. <laughs> Crap. Uh, oh! Whoa! N d d the Mega... You just have an Arceus just chilling. Like, that d d doesn't worry me at all. Oh, shoot, Benugans. Okay, so. I'm getting out of this situation. Um, and I'm going to U-turn from the Vaporeon. Because... Yeah. Um, I'm... I did, yeah, this is not... I mean, I'm going to say this is not good a hundred times. I'm sorry. I get worried. Uh, ha -ha. I hate that the breast option is just Brittany. Like, use Brittany to kill everything. Brittany is so dying when I, when the chance comes. Like, like I'm sad. Like, I, I already know. I already know. Like, it's another, it's another role situation. Like, and the value that it's already another role situation is hilarious. But Brittany had her run, you know? Like, she did. She did. She killed it, but also, like, she did too good. Like, you get too good at your job, you get punished. You're too nice, you get punished. Like, the world has a way of punishing in any way, shape, or form that it wants to. And this is how it's gonna punish Brittany. Brittany's gonna have to take care of things that she's not used to taking care of. And then it's goodbye. Um... Um, hi, level 53 Pokemon. Um, yeah, uh, I thought your ace was 
50? Not 53. Oh my gosh, wait. I targeted him the, the, the Vaporeon slot. No! Oh no! Uh-oh. 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 This is not good. <laughs> uh, that's better than I anticipated. Please go into please go into Mega. Nope, it's not into Mega. But we are specially defensive. And a CRIT did not KILL, so that works. Uh, I'm okay with that. What's the mod that's coming up next? It's uh, Jinx. I'm worried about the double target. But do I think the Jinx would target into me? Like, what does the Jinx have that would target into me? It could psychic me. I'm gonna play it safe. Gosh, this is such a waste of high approaches, but I'm playing it safe. I have to. I have to play it safe. Arceus is flailing on the wrong Pokemon, as always. Good job, Mega. And Zen Headbutt into me or onto the Arceus. Okay, so me playing it safe might have been a good thing. Oh, yeah, it definitely was a good thing. They double targeted into Mega, and that was not a crit. Hi, um, I thought you were an Arceus. Apparently, you're not an Arceus. Wait, you just popped a swap into a, into your own Jinx? Mega, why, what are you doing? <laughs> why did you pop the swap? What does your Jinx have that I don't know about? Also, nice job, Brittany. Uh, getting rid of the threat. That's the threat. Freaking Brittany out here doing everything. Literally. Like. Oh, wait. You, 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 you switched into your. Why? <laughs> Just let your arms just die. You're, you're not Nuzlocking. I'm Nuzlocking. Oh, well. <laughs> At least I can kill the Jinx. <laughs> unless it, unless they decide to pop a swap too. But that I highly doubt. Oh my gosh. That's amazing. So, here's why it's amazing. So, <laughs> Mega popped the swap for the Executor. That I ended up critting and killing that turn. <laughs> <laughs> like you can't script that which is just amazing like naturally it the, the and i'm sure mega's over here like oh my gosh why did you kill the one i was targeting like in the game not in real life so it's just like oh well <laughs> oopsies um well i didn't think you were gonna try and target that but you did but that should be a kill for both ones i would i would think right I'd ha you'd have to think it's a kill Oh, it is, because Avalanche. <laughs> okay, so there's two mods left. It's a Glaceon, which is another mod I can Heat Wave. That's your ace. And an Empoleon, which is another mod I can Heat Wave. What the heck? Because <laughs> the Empoleon targets into the Jinx. Oh, I can't Heat Wave it. That's right, Empoleon has Drizzle. Empoleon is actually a god. I forgot about that. Um, so Drizzle and Polion that we can't do anything about because uh, we kind of have weakness to water. We have a mild weakness to water. Is this where Dakon special defense can come in handy though? I'm gonna try it. Because Dakon, Dakon helps here. Theoretically speaking. And we know you've got a Bone Rush Pokemon in the bag. So it actually might make sense to kill the Jinx if they don't do it for me. I 
I might have to... Yeah, they did it for me. Cool, thank you. I was like, so this is where I would send out your Arceus, please. Arceus, please? Jolteon. Okay, so your last spot's a Jolteon, so you're going for the Empoleon. I feel like that's a frail, frail poke. The, the Glaceon's pretty frail, so I think it actually low kick does less than Poison Fang does here. Um, oh, does that hit everybody? I think that actually hits everybody. Um, why? Please, please don't hit everybody. Okay, please, good. It does not hit everybody. But the Poison Fang does not kill. There's no way. Like, there's no way it kills, right? Like, yeah, oh my gosh, yeah, this thing is defensive. Oh, And a rain boosted muddy water hits both of us. It does not kill any of us. I, I was not faster than the Jolteon. Why did I do that? I was literally not faster than the Jolteon. I and, and I knew it was going for that. Oops. Well, at least we're gonna see if I, Low Kick was better on the Glaceon or not, because I was dumb. <laughs> or I could have been really smart and Glaceon's just a hefty, hefty boy, but I don't think it is. I, I, I truly do not think it's a hefty boy. I guess it's a hefty boy. Oh, okay. Oh, boy. Yep, I didn't think it was hefty, but apparently it is. Okay, just kill it, please. Bye. Oh, you crit it. Thanks. Thanks, Nick. <laughs> or Mega. My god. I keep... Ah, I hate that I'm calling this this Nick. Joy, let me heal your Pokemon. Thank you. Let me not, like... <sighs> oh, boy. Oh. The whole... Oh, the guy skipped the cutscene. Okay. A Bronzong. And I'm leading Ernesto. Good good job, John. Okay. I mean, it's not like I knew it, it was coming. Uh, that's neutral. Any steel move would be neutral. Uh, but it does not have levitate. Roomba, it's your time to shine! Roomba, you can do it! for revenge. Cyrus is out for blood. Cyrus is out for blood. Cyrus is out for blood. He's already killed. He's already murdered Roomba, which is literally the whole reason I added Roomba to the team was for Salamences. Oh, gosh. Dang it. Why did I... So Roomba has so many weaknesses then. Like, Roomba's actually... Sorry, Bri, but Roomba's actually bad. <laughs> It is weak to all three elemental types. Steel, fighting. I love Roomba. And then, then, then this happens. What? And then of course it crit. Because I, I, I highly doubt that a non-crit kills there. Like, oh boy. This thing, Brittany gets to take care of again. Because Brittany just takes care of literally everything at this point. Murder at Brittany. Just, just, just do the fight, Brittany. No, oh, good. You can't actually. Why? I mean, I guess Lucario can do his original job then. <laughs> like, I'm saying why and being mad because, well, I mean, would you not be? Would you be mad if you lost your Pokemon? I, I, I believe so. But, uh. I saw that was a Raichu too. 
I mean, hey, at least, again, Lucario's got a purpose. So I'm not mad about that. Because it, all it can do is set up, and then we just murder it with an extreme speed. So Lucario, I guess, just wanted to keep its purpose. Doesn't sound like anybody else I know, but, you know, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> it makes sense though, because like if you're getting stripped away of your purpose, then you just feel terrible. Just like how Dell had a massive purpose in Mudblock, where he literally soloed the entirety of Omega Ruby and Alpha South, or not Omega Ruby, Ruby and Sapphire, um, or I guess Ruby, because that's what I did. But like it's literally like what the heck. I'm mad. I, I, I'm upset. I am genuinely upset at the fact that that just happened. Like... And our, and, and our encounters are Rage Rock. All of this for the, one of the worst legendaries in Pokemon. Yes. Do that more. Give me the worst Pokemon I could have. Bye. I don't want to catch you. Whoa, you actually killed your legendary encounter? Why? I, 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 because I wanted to. I didn't want my legendary encounter because it was gross. It was a red draw. This is the second. Oh, God. Do I really? Okay. This is the second episode where I gotta go find a Pokemon I wanna add to the team. <laughs> like, how sad is that? This is. I, I am not used to multiple episodes in a row where I have to go find out and plus like Roomba was our newest member like Roomba's entire like they're just like like what do I think what and how do I replace a Roomba like I don't I don't know how to do that if you, if you think I know how to replace a Roomba then who are like who do you think I am a god that's definitely not me uh gosh dang it Roomba I literally just had you, and I was super excited. I even made a poll with you instantaneously because I loved you that much, and then you just die on me to the first thing you come into being a crit. <laughs> like, and it's sad because that's totally how Ruba would die. Like, 100% Ruba dies that way, of all ways. So it's like, uh... Are we literally gonna add Tito? Please tell me. If I have a water stone, I think I might add Tito. I have a flame. What, sto what stones do I have? Flame orb. Yeah, no, I have a water stone. It actually makes sense to add Tito. Because that's another water. Training something up to level 1 to 55, though. Like, ugh. But it, it, it is doable, and I think it has to be done because what does Tito have? Oh well, I just withdrawed. I I, I, I I guess I made my decision. But oh, we only know pluck. Okay. I mean, here's okay. So here's what I'm thinking. So Tito gets added to the team. Yes, 100%. I agree because grass. We'll take care of my water weakness that I had. Um, with the water typing, then I don't have to worry about steel either. And then I have a good fire, water, grass core in Brittany, Tito, and Bay. And then Ernesto just hangs out. Lucario takes care of electric types, which would be a problem, but with Volt Absorb, it's not. So synergetically, that's if that's even a word, that would make sense. That way I'm not adding the broken mod. Like, I'm not, I don't want to add the broken mon. I'm really trying to fray away from the broken mon. Uh, because I'm at a point where I could totally add the broken mon. Well, I was, but no. I just, no, I don't want to. So, anyways, thank you guys so very much for watching today's episode. I hope you guys had a wonderful day. Um, I lost mon, so it was kind of sad for me. But, you know, I did some other things that were fun over time, so I can't complain about the entirety of the day because I did have some fun. Although, I'll leave you with the comment question of the day because I usually don't do that. But what game do you play that just automatically triggers you? Let me know in the comment section below. I'll tell you that mine is Luigi Mansion 3. Gross, but yeah, it's true. Uh, but I hope you all and hope you have a wonderful one. Bye.